Today we start a new segment on The Buzz where we take you inside some of the area's best restaurants and show you what's on the menu. It's a gem tucked into a cool little neighborhood. We try to get here at least once a week. It's fast, it's convenient, it's healthy. It's different. It's delicious. 30 seats, uh, monthly changing menu. The kitchen post is the creation of Poland native Ross Fowler. It's been uh, snowballing since the moment we opened. Thanks in part to their Taco Tuesdays. I'm here for Taco Tuesday. They come in and they have the tacos and they're foolproof. They're delicious, good price, and just all around enjoyable for pretty much anyone. Everyone, Everyone loves tacos. likes tacos. Yes. I got the tacos. I got the hot chicken tacos. I'm having tacos. It's Taco Tuesday. And they were awesome. There's so many different kinds and everything is fresh and crunchy. Last Tuesday, 180 people were in a 30 seat restaurant. Even more popular is their Saturday and Sunday brunch. Biscuits and gravy, bacon, egg and cheese biscuits, chorizo, egg and cheese, poblano jelly biscuits, chicken and waffles. But the menu is increasingly becoming known for its more creative items, at least Fowler says, among those willing to try them. But now we have a steady clientele to where it doesn't matter. I can put anything on that menu and it'll sell, and that's taken a year to get there, but the first six months it was not like that. I've tried a lot of different things and when I say I've tried a lot of different things some of the things I've never tried before and they're quite good. But one dish she hasn't tried is the octopus. There's not many octopus people. I have to convince them that it's good. We're going to do the uh, gnocchi potato salad, crispy octopus. We'll take our octopus which we cooked for two hours already. Drop those in. We're just going to deep fry them, get them crispy. Okay so we'll make our potato salad dressing, some scallion, a little salt and pep. Not technically a soft boiled egg, but it's a six minute egg. And apparently, I love octopus. <laughs> if I continually put out a good product, which I've done, and make sure it's pristine, everything, then people will start to believe it. People come here, they order things that they don't even think they want just for the adventure of it. On a whim, we decided to try it, and once we did, we were hooked. And coming up with adventurous dishes for them to try is what keeps Fowler going. I like that it's a craft that I can apply technical skills to, but I can expand on it and pull different ideas from all over the place. And there are plans for another restaurant in the works. can't say exactly what. I can say that we're looking at other locations for a, a different concept altogether. New concept or not, Fowler says he wants to continue to push himself creatively. Because I'm not going to change what I'm doing. I'm, I'm pushing it further is what I'm doing. It's reasonably priced and it's different from the usual. If people are out looking for something different to try, I would definitely make the effort to come here and, and give it a whirl. You might find something that you like. 